Welcome back to episode 159, May 5th to 7th. Driver almost fails to yield when turning left and almost turns left in front of me. Stop signaling in the middle of the... Oncoming Hyundai driver has trouble staying on their side of the road and adjusts to the right side when they see me. Four-way stop sign runners on the right. Or always stop sign, whatever you call it, same thing. They're labeling them always stop signs in Edmonton now, which is interesting because up until, like, I'd say last year, they were all called four-way stop signs. Driver stops at the green arrow and then turns into the wrong lane and then speeds off into the distance. <laughs> Shocker runs this red light. Idiot suddenly swings a left turn in front of me. Stop sign runners up ahead. Focus runs the right turn on red. Just a side note for a second. Some people think running the right turn on red means just turning right on red. It means running a red light without stopping when turning red. Civic makes an unnecessarily wide turn, then stops half a car length behind the driver in front of them for no reason. And does it again, along with the driver in front of him, who's almost a car length behind the car in front of him. This driver is speeding, going 60 kilometers an hour in a 50 zone. There's a red light and speed camera here, I'm Sign runner. Driver in the right lane is nice enough to back up for the driver in the alley who doesn't even want to go there. What an asshole. At least fucking let him know. A nice driver turns right with no signal. Light runners up ahead. Another red light runner. Echo driver completely blows this stop sign. Rolling stop is not a stop. And big surprise does it one more time. This driver acts bothered that they have to get on their side of the road and takes their sweet ass time doing it. Drivers, these this time in the left lane, both stopping half a car length behind the car in front of them. Why do people love doing this in Edmonton? I don't fucking get it. Red light runners. Taxi runs the right turn on red, where he's not even allowed to turn. Only cyclists can turn right on red here. Jeep driver on the right, blue jeep, you can see the lights, stops at a green light, and doesn't get going until people honk at them. Honestly, what the fuck? I'd love to know why the police officer two cars back did nothing. Dick runs the red light. Cruise driver on the left has no clue where he wants to go and suddenly gets in the left turn lane from a straight only red light runners and look where the cruise ended up going straight. Driver on the right runs their stop sign as they turn left and no turn signal. Shocking.
another stop sign runner. Drivers driving with high beams on. You're not on the highway, you're in a neighborhood. Shut them off. Driver here got pulled over and cars getting towed here at Grot Road Victoria Trail intersection. No idea what happened, but must have been a drunk driver. Two drivers run the right turn on red in the right lane next to me. driver on the right is being let in by me. I'm even waving my hand at him out the window and he's not paying attention. Takes his sweet ass time doing so because, oh, they wanted the left lane all the way from the right. Stupid Subaru SUV driver goes from the straighter right lane into the right lane that they suddenly need because it's special apparently. Then runs the right turn on red, turning with no signal. And look where they ended up, in the left lane. If this isn't a fucking idiot, I don't know what is. Man on the right runs the right turn on red. Red light runners. FS truck runs the right turn on red on the right, and there's a very late green arrow runner ahead of us. Nobody honks at them because they're just too nice, apparently. Red light runners, and this Volkswagen turns into the wrong lane. Light runner ahead. You ever heard of changing lanes later? No, that would just be too normal and logical, right? Caravan runs the right turn on red. Every single vehicle in front of me turns into the wrong lane. Stop sign runners up ahead. Oncoming driver runs a yellow light and makes the Civic driver turn on red. Four drivers in the right lane run the right turn on red. So do another three. Taxi is parked in a very illegal and bad place, making this driver have a very hard time turning right. Range Rover driver almost turns right from the left lane, but then sees me. I honked, or else they wouldn't have seen me. Clip is sped up two times for uh, episode length. This driver is just another one that thinks inching up to the light will make it change faster. How about you just stop at the stop line, not way behind it, and maybe it will. It again. You know, the sensors for the light won't be activated unless you're at the stop line, but because you're not, 
Guess what happens? You have to wait longer. Too fucking bad. When they do get going, they go 35, 15 kilometers an hour under the limit for absolutely no reason, can't even hold their lane. Idiot. Fucking idiot. This Ram driver doesn't feel like waiting for traffic to pass by for when he's parallel parking on one of the busiest streets downtown. He doesn't even give me a thank you wave for backing up and letting him go. You, sir, can go fuck yourself. Another idiotic cyclist that wants to get killed here by illegally lane splitting and going through the crosswalk where there's no lane. This guy got a lot of horn from me. At the front of the line, sits at the green light when it's absolutely clear to turn left and nobody's coming. And the Accord driver in front of me signals left as they're turning. The Accord driver is stopped in front of the stop line. The laser driver decides to exit at the last second from the left lane. And caravan driver goes suddenly into the left lane from the exit. And the same RAV4 driver as before turns right from the left lane with no signal. The oncoming white SUV driver is going ridiculously slow for someone going straight, only going about 45 kilometers an hour in a 60 zone for no reason. Thank you for making me wait, you idiot. The driver on the right acts like they don't have a stop sign and almost pulls out in front of me. And passes me at 15 kilometers an hour over the limit at a speed change, or it goes down to 50. Let's see if I can slow down for the speed change, so can you. You wouldn't just have to be braking all the time for the curves in the road if you just hit the speed limit. The huge idiot RAV4 driver here almost stops in the middle of the road before suddenly deciding to turn left and almost causes a pile up. Good job, you idiot. Construction? is not an excuse to run the red light. Sorry.